Aquilino. Aquilino, okay. Hi, Paul Sack, it's Good News Plan. I'm here with Lisa Aquilino. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? All right, good. So what brings you here tonight? This wonderful occasion to be part of the Samuel Waxman Foundation. Okay, are you uh, uh, connected more than attended? I am. I had the good fortune of meeting Dr. Waxman about six months ago through one of my good friends. And he started telling me about the foundation and what he does. And I was so inspired to become part of it. So I'm going to continue to try to raise money to help fight his battle. He's an amazing person. And I just really think the world of him and his wife. Uh -huh. Do you have, unfortunately, family or friends that have going through this kind of a I do like time. yes like all of us I think we know at, you know at least a handful of people that have been affected with cancer one of my good friends actually uh, was diagnosed and operated on yesterday and oh. thankfully very successful okay. and um, you know it's 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 a disease that affects everyone unfortunately in some way shape or form so you then see the vision of uh, research to finally come up with some answers absolutely absolutely and the way that he does his research and what he looks into as is alternative and and it's just i think really uh, a, a different way of looking at attacking cancer okay two last quick questions one is we're a good news broadcast and okay we started off talking about you know I guess always when there's difficult moments in the world they can uh, overshadow the True. good that's happening in the world so I asked many True. people these two questions one is what is good news for you good news for me on a daily basis is knowing that everybody that I know is happy and healthy okay and the last question we're very involved with world peace actually international day of peace okay on september 21st so i've asked thousands of people what does peace mean to them uh well unfortunately this week we see a lot of unrest so i would like to see no racial divides any longer i mean kind of going backwards in our in our culture and everyone should be loved for who they are beautiful thank you so much thank you bye-bye